This is Jolie here for Seconds Out. Delighted to be joined by Zach Chelly. You've had a fight announced recently, which you're going to be getting stuck into. But first things first, Zach, good to speak to you, man. How are you doing? Oh, I'm feeling great. I'm looking forward to this fight. Yes, of course. Leroy Richards is the man you're going to be fighting. Great yeah. opponent. When did you find out that this would be the next opponent for yourself? Uh, about a week before it's actually going to be announced. Um, wow. I, I accepted straight away. Since they called me and said, fight, yes, I'll take the fight. And they said he was still trying to work out with him. And then he finally accepted. So, yeah, it's all great. Five wins on the bounce. So, you're going to go into this fight with more confidence than, than ever before? Confident for every fight. So, yeah, as long as I train hard and I believe in myself, yeah, God willing, I'll go to plan. What do you think of Lerone? Um, yeah, people say he's a very technical boxer. Um, honestly, I haven't seen much of him. People say he's quite boring, and he is quite boring to watch, not going to lie. Like, so I saw his last fight. I believe I watched the first three rounds, and I, I just switched the channel. Uh, but, of course, I'm going to have to go back and watch it now. Um, but, yeah, to learn what to do and stuff. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Was it one of those, you didn't even think twice about this? He, He's a very, obviously, skilled fighter. And um, his last time out, he looked the best he ever has. Although people will say it's not the most entertaining, his skill set is extremely high. Yeah, of course, uh, people say I'm going to watch it. I, I, yeah, I believe he's a very skillful fighter. Of course, he's undefeated. Uh, he's, he's what? He's number six in the world, ranked by Box Red. European Rep. champ, yeah. Yeah, European, IBO World title, um, British champion. So, yeah, I'm looking forward. I believe I've, I should have been an English champion three years ago and mm -hmm. I should have had these titles by now. So, you know, God works in mysterious ways and God willing, I will beat him and he'll put me in a position where I believe I should have been. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. So what's the next few months or, or month going to look like? It's just over until the fight. How do yeah. you prepare for this tricky style? Have you actually looked into him yet? You said you haven't yet looked back at his fights properly yet or in full. <laughs> yeah, well... You know, in the ring, is always going to be different. You can train, you can prepare, you can do whatever you want. But as soon as you get in the ring, you're always going to find out it's different. Of course, I've had lots of, I'm, I'm having lots of southpaw sparring. Yeah. You know, I'm, I've been fine with southpaws. My first fight was a southpaw. I fought a southpaw after that as well. So, yeah, I'm, I'm fine with it. Just had lots of southpaw sparring, getting used to the different styles. But I'm already, I've already been used to it. I've always had southpaw sparring. So, I'm actually quite, I'm pretty confident and looking forward to it. How's uh, teaching on the side? Have you been uh, off okay. the for a bit? Um, I'm finished. Remember, I said I quit my job. From oh my yes, I'm not we, getting back we, into teaching. Yes, I do remember that. Actually, apologies. Yeah, so you're full, full in now. So no, no distractions for this fight. No yeah. It was a tiring job teaching and then coming home and training. This time, I'm fully focused on training and make sure make sure I get that victory. Good to hear. Good to hear. Um, I just want to know what you make of the main event as well. Obviously, Adam Azim's now stepping up mm. against Ryland Charlton. Um, how do you see Adam Azim as one of the big prospects people are making him out to be in the country at the moment? He's great. He's very popular. He speaks well. He looks good. He plays <laughs> the part well. Um, his opponent, I think he went to the finals of the boxer tournament, didn't yes. he? So it was a pretty tough one. I saw him. He won uh, by a knockout on a Sky show against another popular boxer, the bomber or something. Uh, did he also fight with Marco? Marco, Marco? Yes, yeah, Florian Marco. Did he yeah. lost some points or did Marco stop him? Yeah, yeah, no, he, I think it was a, he, I think he dropped Marco. Marco claimed it wasn't a knockdown. Okay. Okay. Um, but he's, he's got a good um, fight ahead of him. Adam Azim, it's going to be very Yeah, so it's going to be a tough fight for Adam Azim. If Adam Azim does stop him, I believe he's going to prove that he's the real deal. Third fight this year, this is going to be. Um, do you feel like it's been up until this day and then you imagine you're going to be successful a good year as it, it could have gone? Yeah, of course. I've won an English title this year. I had to, uh, began the year with a beautiful knockout. Yeah, it's gone, it's gone great. And I'm looking forward to finishing the year with a bang. Well, I'm looking It'll forward the, to what? The fight, the fight will be a day after my birthday. So I, my birthday's on the 26th. The fight's on the 27th. So it'll be a great birthday present. There you go. Great way to uh, end it. It's been good to speak to you ahead of what's going to be a really good fight. I'm looking forward to seeing the clash of styles. Um, Lerone's obviously a top talent and you've proved in, in your last five that, that you're um, a top talent. Even before that, um, it's going to be a good fight. Alexandra Palace as well. A uh, nice little venue to see it all go down. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Great venue, great atmosphere. 
good good fights on the card as well. So I know people enjoy it. Tickets should be out on Wednesday, 26. So yeah, I'm happy. Looking forward to them. What's the first thing you're going to do to celebrate? You're going to have some Italian food, some food in North London. What What's the plan? Uh, celebration will be having my hands raised up high. That'll be my celebration. That's all I need. Yeah. That's all you need. Thanks a lot, man. I appreciate your time. <laughs> Thank you.